All right, this is from another online attendee. Maria from West Hills, California. What can conservatives do to convince liberals who listen to propaganda on the mainstream media that conservative values are what the founding fathers envisioned for our nation? You know, at the Daily Wire, we're having this little quarrel where Nikki Haley said that you shouldn't try to own the left, you shouldn't mock them, you should try to convince them. And Ben Shapiro agreed with that, and Michael Knowles said, no, no, let's own the left and mock them. You know, that would be more fun. <laughs> And, and I said, if, if you whippersnappers can't do both, you're just not working hard enough, you know? So I think, I think it, is, it is really important to make rational arguments that show you can trace from the Constitution and the Declaration exact, not exactly what the founders meant, but pretty much the general idea of what they meant. They meant there to be limited powers, they meant there to be enumerated powers, they meant there to be separation of powers, and they meant individuals to be free, and they believed that all of this stuff was underpinned by God. That, that it was natural law underpinned by God. You can make that argument, but you should also make fun of them. What they're saying is absurd. What they're saying is ridiculous. Make it hot for them. You know, just, just really give it to them. I mean, why do you think they beat people up? Why do you think they show up in masks with sticks? Because they know they're ridiculous, you know? They have no sense of humor. Their comedy is dead. We, we are the funniest people now on the internet. You know, and, and, and you know, look at us, we're conservatives. We shouldn't be the funniest people, but we are, you know? <laughs> And, and I just think that those are the two ways forward, conviction and, and mockery. And the, and the mockery is probably more important. 